Hello, my name is Nicholas Tindall and I'm part of the Tugger project. What follows is a brief video that demonstrates how to import Power BI report templates into the desktop app and its publication to Microsoft's online Power BI service. It presumes that your first Tugger is finished. Your Tugger account should display how many rows are being used. It doesn't matter if a tug is currently ongoing as long as the tug you wish to import has completed. As you can see here, this tug has never never tugged, but this one has completed. The following steps should have already been done before attempting to import a template into Power BI Desktop. Team Viewer is needed if you want us to install them on your machine. It is, however, a straightforward process. Microsoft's Power BI service, which can be added to an Office 365 account, also needs to be accessible. It is currently available as a free trial. Power BI Desktop will also need downloading and installing before the installation of the report templates. To publish to the Power BI service, you will also need to sign into your organization's account in the desktop app. Ideally, once Power BI service has been added, create a workspace for the Tugger reports. This allows for others within your organization to be included and their permission level set whilst restricting what reports they can access. It may make sense for there to be multiple workspaces where specific reports are published and used as, as added as appropriate. That, however, is beyond the scope of this video tutorial. Once all the above has been done, access your cache tug or alternate, alternatively Harvest or HubSpot via view details. Navigate to Analytics Setup. These details are required in Power BI Desktop to import your data. The username and password will also be required for refreshing the reports in the Power BI service. Leave this page available for later due to their requirement. Open Power BI Desktop. You should see something similar to this. Close the splash screen and select File, Import, Power BI Template. Navigate to where the templates are and open one of them. I'll demonstrate with cached jobs. It could just as easily be another template, be it Harvest or HubSpot. Copy the OData URL seen in the Analytics Setup page of Tugger displayed previously, and paste into the Tugger URL field, then click Load. This demonstration leaves the logo field blank, which some, play, some templates may not even include. If this is the first report you've imported for this particular Tug, you will be asked for authentication details. When this request option appears, select Basic. Copy and paste the username and password from the same page as the OData URL in the Analytics Setup page. Change the level to match the one above, then click Connect. Depending on how much data you have, they can take some minutes to load. Uh, pause this video if you need to. Once completed, you should be presented with a Reports app. You can examine and adjust the reports within Power BI Desktop. However, we are just going to publish to the workspace displayed earlier. Click Publish, then Save. Give the job report a name that makes sense to you and then save it. When the Publish to Power BI Destination pop-up appears, select the one required. If you didn't see, set up one earlier, or previously, then the only option will be My Workspace. If you wish to set up a workspace now, you will need to cancel and publish again once the workspace is set up. We are going to continue. A publishing dialog will appear. Once completed, success is indicated, along with the option to open the report in Power BI Service. And that's it for publishing to Microsoft Service.
thank you for watching.